Hey guys, today I'm going to unbox the 1 4 scale Tsumugi Kotobuki from Freeing. I'm Kyoko. So I ordered this figure a few months ago on Solaris Japan and she was pre-owned. She took ages to arrive, but now she's finally here and I'm really excited to unbox her. The box is actually kind of nice. She's an older bunny and she has these metallic golden moon circles around the box. And a funny detail that I noticed is that there's the figure of Mugi as a bunny on the moon and I don't know if you know it but in Japan people think or see a bunny in the moon so yeah that's a cute little detail on the packaging. So she was pre-owned but I don't think the box has been opened yet. At least the tape still looks here but yeah let's just pop her open. She's actually just the second bunny in my collection and the first one with real, real tights so I'm excited to experience that. The box looks a little bit worn, but I don't mind that at all. Oh, I'm so excited! And she actually looks very big. Uh, her head looks quite a lot bigger than my Diana 1 4 scale, but obviously Kaon has a different style of bigger heads. Ah, I'm so excited! Oops, she's a little bit top heavy. So it's rather put her down like that and yeah the inside of the box is just golden holographic material as well but we're not here for the box so i think she's actually brand new or somebody put a lot of effort into packaging her again because uh, she's wrapped up everywhere still and oh my god she looks amazing uh, yeah all the protective packaging is still on there and the box was sealed as well so yeah I don't know maybe she was new or somebody just bought, bought her and never unboxed her okay so the bunny ears come pre-attached uh, she's very she's really big ah uh, I really like her I think she's actually one of the oldest or at least one of the older freeing bunnies okay yeah I really like her face it's really really cute I mean glossy eyes would be nice but we all know Fring doesn't do glossy eyes. I really like the shading of her waistcoat or something, of her top. Uh, the shading of the red looks very, very nice. Also, it's kind of a different, more interesting bunny suit than uh, most of the regular Fring bunnies have. The tights look very nice as well. Really, really cool. The paintwork on her isn't perfect. There are a few imperfections, for example, on the right part on her of her top or the mouth isn't super super clean but she's an older thing i don't know when she was released so i'm not mad at that at all her hair scalp is a little bit lacking it's a little bit plainer especially on the back but yeah i think freeing isn't really well known for their great hair scalps but the sculpting of the ears looks very nice they look very puffy and they look like real leather and they hit the trademark thing on the inside of the ear so that's kind of funny okay so obviously there's not much assembling to be done you just pop her out of the box and she's ready to go but she's very sturdy and i really really like her i'm very happy that i bought her i also like her kneeling down pose i think she's one of my first sitting or kneeling figures i don't think i have any other ones except maybe my skill which is sitting on a horse but yeah that's something different and I also like that the pose isn't too sexy or too uh, revealing or anything because obviously Mui is a younger character so yeah I think uh, they really did a great job on her. I have to say the shoes aren't my favorite design wise they look a little bit like old lady shoes but that's okay. At least the ankle straps are attached to the shoe. I think with most of the newer freeing bunnies the ankle strap isn't really attached to the shoe it's more like a bracelet kind of thing. Her nails are also painted which is cute. They aren't perf painted perfectly but it's nonetheless a nice detail and yeah I think she's really really cute. I also think the character choice is kind of interesting from Freeing because uh, Mio obviously is the most popular character from Kaon but they chose to do Mugi which I think it's cool because Mugi is my favorite character from Kaon, but they didn't do the other girls, which is kind of sad. But I'm very, very happy with the movie, and I think she looks great on her own as well. I'm really happy to have another one fourth scale for my collection, and finally a bunny girl with actual tights. I think that's really cool. And yeah, what do you think about this figure? Let me know in the comments, and see you next time. Bye!